Zum Finale des Race Across America stehen schweren Appalachen-Etappen auf dem Programm, vor denen Kurt Matzler großen Respekt hat. Haben sie doch 4000 bzw. sogar 5000 Höhenmeter zu überwinden. Wenn ein Radrennen wie das Race Across America über einen ganzen Kontinent führt, dann ist die Navigation ein ganz zentrales Thema. Die aktuellen Daten müssen täglich eingespielt werden, in alle Systeme, auch für den Rennfahrer, in alle Navigationssysteme der Autos. Umleitungen müssen programmiert werden. Und diese, diese ganz schwierige Aufgabe passiert in Innsbruck, zu Hause bei uns. Denn hier sitzt Andreas und Irene Seemann, die das in einer exzellenten Art und Weise für uns hier in Amerika machen. Unser Rotary Rams Polio Team hat auch ein, eine amerikanische Crew mit dabei und unter ihnen auch der Gründer dieses Teams, Bob McKenzie. Bob, you founded the Rotary Rams Polio Team 2016. Maybe can you say just a few words uh, to your American crew and then later on uh, to the idea of Rams, uh, Rotary Rams Polio? Sure. We have Bill Clark with us. And Bill was our crew chief our first year in 2016, got the job at the last minute and did a great job for us. And then my wife Darlene has been on the crew uh, forever and uh, she was a crew chief uh, 17, 18 and 19. And she also does all of our logistics and setting up the hotels and stuff for the whole team uh, as we cross the country. And in 2016 you were also part of the team, of the team who, as a driver, Yeah, I was a rider in 2016, all four years. I was one of the racers and, uh, uh, you know, we had a four, we changed out some of our racers through the years, but Kurt and I were the only two that rode all four years. And now, of course, he's going solo. Aha! <laughs> When you found the, the team or you established this Rotary Rams Polio team, did you ever expect that it will be a story like this and such a success also in the fundings for Empolio? You know, when you do things, sometimes um, if you knew how hard it was going to be before you started, you probably wouldn't do it. And so uh, it's a good thing we don't always know that because this has been a tremendous success and a lot of children have been saved from polio because of this effort. And we've raised over $4 million dollars in the five years we've done it. The first year we didn't raise very much. We were so... You know, we were such a learning curve for us, but um, it has been great to continue on, and Kurt's been a big part of that. He's really helped push us along on that. Thank you, Bob. Thank you, Bill. Thank you, Darlene. Das war ein kleiner Blick auf unser amerikanisches Team hier in der Crew von Rotary Rams Polio auf dem Weg von Oceanside nach Annapolis.